You know, I'm grieved today. I'm grieved in my spirit, in my heart, grieved for America. I was just on the internet looking at the faces and the names of the 17 people that were killed in that school shooting in Parkland, Florida. And my heart just reaches out. It breaks for the families of those who died, also for the other victims that are in hospitals, for their families, for the community, for the state, also for America. The kind of trauma and senseless tragedies that have been occurring. It's only been just like four and a half months since the mass shooting in Las Vegas where I live. And I just felt like I wanted to take a minute to pray. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, I pray for America. I pray against this spirit of violence and trauma that the enemy has brought. I pray, Lord God, that you would help all of those who have been injured, traumatized, the fear that has been injected into their lives, uh, the spirit of strife that has come in to try to divide people up over it and over the answers. And I just pray, Lord God, for revival. We need prayer back in schools. We need revival in America. We need the glory of the Lord to come in. That's the true answer. There are other answers, Lord, that the wisdom of God can bring to us as a nation, politically, sociologically. It's got to be the government of God that superimposes itself over the government of man. It has to be a spiritual change and shift in our nation before the physical realm can change. But we just pray, Lord, for all those in Parkland now. Bless them, heal them, comfort their hearts, lead them to the Lord Jesus Christ, an understanding of His love and of His compassion for them, Heal families. Heal our nation, Lord God. I pray that in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. God bless you all.